Gervasi Vineyard is changing course for the time being, going from vineyard, distillery and event host to making hand sanitizer. Will Uick has that story from Canton. On March 15th, when the governor ordered closure, you know, our world was literally turned upside down. The halting of dining and restaurants and banning of large gatherings has taken a toll on Gervasi Vineyard. We shut down our four restaurants. Uh, we had to lay off over 300 employees. So with their backs against the wall and wanting to figure out a way to help the area during this difficult time. We said, how can we get involved and put this piece of equipment to use to help the community? Scott and the Gervasi team found a way to repurpose what they already do into something desperately needed. Well, the key ingredients to a hand sanitizer are, are alcohol, which that, that we know how to do, but it has to actually be done at a much higher proof. So we had to educate ourselves on how to make that happen. So we're completely converting to 100% focused on uh, what hand sanitizer we can make uh, and, and how fast we can make it. The distillery here at Gervasi was built and set up a few years ago to make a handful of craft spirits. So to switch gears and turn into a full-fledged producer of sanitizer is a bit of an undertaking. From a new process to new bottles and new labels, all the way down to halting the great business altogether and switching to corn. Swartz Farm, just literally just a few miles down the road from us, we were using their corn to make our bourbon. Well, the same corn can be used to make the grain neutral spirits that we need for the hand sanitizer. Once they were able to get the ingredients squared away, the next hurdle was packaging. And because typical hand sanitizer bottles are in short supply, they decided to go with an unconventional container. What we could find and what we could get fast were 18 ounce barbecue sauce bottles. The initial production of sanitizer will be given to frontline medical facilities in Stark County. So we're gonna start in our backyard and the hospitals and those uh, areas taking care of, you know, obviously people who are very ill and need it most. It's a long way from hosting weddings and making alcoholic drinks, but as the saying goes, when life hands you grapes, we're in crisis management mode. Our entire business has been turned upside down. Make some hand sanitizer. When we came up with, you know, how we can help the community, everybody's really energized by that. Will Uick. They want to do something to help. 3 News.